about their masjid and they have two Friday prayers. One for the vaccine, the first prayer. The other one is for those who refuse to take the vaccine. So he says, is this permissible? The answer is no. And this is not my opinion. This is the opinion of the uh, 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 Grand Committee of IFTA that a masjid cannot have more than one Friday prayer. Unlike what's happening in Europe, Be even before the pandemic, I remember going to a masjid in London that they prayed two or three Jumu'ah at 12.15, then at 1 o'clock, then at 1.30 or something like that. And the scholars and the muftis, they say that this is not permissible because this defies the purpose of Jumu'ah, unlike other prayers where you can have another prayer. But when it comes to Jumu'ah, no, you have one khatib delivering one Friday sermon and that's it and one prayer to be led. So what they're doing is wrong. Now, whether it's justifiable because of the pandemic or not, I'm not in a position to give fatwa. I cannot. I have to refer to the uh, mashayikh to um, address this contemporary fatwa until I get the answer, inshallah, maybe I'll update you with that. But my last uh, comment would be to those who refuse to take the vaccine. Now, the conspiracy theorist keep on refusing to take the vaccines. And unfortunately, I know du'at. I know students of knowledge who till date refuse to take the vaccines. Why? They don't want to. It's conspiracy. There is a problem. There is a trick in it. Okay, then prove to me again that all what's happening is not a conspiracy around us. They lose great reward when they cannot go to Umrah or Hajj. They lose great rewards when they cannot travel and give lectures and, 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 and participate in conferences. The funny thing is, look how shaitan messes up with their heads. They even come and ask, okay, Sheikh, can we lie and make a forged uh, uh, or fake certificate that we had, vac had been vaccinated? Subhanallah, now you want to sin in order to justify your actions, this is not realistic. Every single child have been vaccinated at birth from polio, from uh, smallpox, from uh, hepatitis, I think, all, all the, the whole nine yards. And nobody ever stopped their children from being vaccinated. All of us have been vaccinated. Why is it this that you're rejecting? Well, because there's a game behind it. I agree. But the vast majority of the people has, have, had taken it. I personally took the first two shots like eight months ago. And I was blessed to perform Hajj among 60,000 on earth who were able to perform Hajj last year. I was blessed by Allah. I was blessed to be able to travel and to perform Umrah once every month for the past year. I took the booster shot last week only. One week exactly from today. And I'm still kicking. I have no energized bunny in me. So come on, guys. I mean, don't make an issue out of a non-issue. You're losing Umrah. You're losing the chance to go for Hajj just because oh, I don't want to be vaccinated. Up to you. But don't start bending rules in order to justify this uh, uh, claim or refusal of yours.